on Skype. Hello, Tiffany and Waxy. Are you there? I'm here. This hey. is Tiffany. Hey, how you doing? I'm fine. How are you? I'm good. And uh, Hey. Hello. We got, hey. We got both of them. Hello. Hello. How y'all doing? Holy shit. We got both yes. of them on the phone. I thought they were. <laughs> yes. After my phone didn't want to connect us both. <laughs> Oh, okay. I thought y'all was going to use the speaker phone, but we we do have y'all on y'all individual phones, so that's cool. Thank you for joining us. No problem. Oh, you're welcome. Thanks for having us. All right. So um, now that both ladies are on here, let me get right down to it. We are joined with Tiffany Wax and Wax C, together known as the Rockets. They are a wrestling tag team, and they are here with us right now. So um, thank you again, ladies, for joining us. And let's start off with this. Why don't you tell the listeners about yourselves, and we'll start off with Tiffany, and then we'll see we'll go second. Okay. All right. Um, a little bit about myself. Um, I've been in wrestling since April 2004. I started off. You know, just valeting and managing and training, and I took some time off, you know, for marriage, and I had a baby and everything. But I've been in the ring pretty much steady since um, '08, and I generally wrestle around like Tennessee, Georgia, Alabama, just around that general area. Um, if I could take further bookings, you know, I would. Um, with a shoot job, it's kind of hard though, working 40 hours a week. But you know, I'm just doing, you know, what I love and loving what I do. And, of course, I got the best tag team partner in the world. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> that's about it for me. <laughs> oh, oh, I see. All right, well, for me, can I, can I just say ditto? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Um, I, my very first match was February the 21st on uh, 2004. I trained for quite a while, and every show I was like, I can't wait to get out there, I can't wait to get out there, just sitting at the curtain like, oh my gosh, I want to perform, I want to act in front of these people. So, um, 2006, I went to TWA, Dalton, Georgia, and that's where I met everybody, and that's where I met Tiffany at, and we come together last year, December the 3rd or the 4th, I can't remember. But we came together as the Rockets, and we have been kicking butt. Yeah, the fourth. We've been kicking butt ever since. I'm a, I'm a one-time mom of a three-year-old, and I work at Advanced Auto Parts. So the same show that Tiffany goes to, I go to. We go to all the paying ones. Oh, I saw. It's kind of like a package deal now. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't package deal. <laughs> so, so how did... They- so how did this tag team got together? Was it based on a company? You know, we've took off since just December. Now, mm-hmm. I'm looking at your f- schedule on your Facebook page, which, by the way, people can join their fan page and check out the complete schedule of when they're wrestling at a wing near you at uh, facebook.com forward slash the Rockets zero one. That's their official Facebook fan page. Uh, the uh, Rockets Zero One. Y'all got a lot of uh, shows that y'all gonna be a part of within the next couple of months, including the one on April the 30th, I believe, which is uh, at Tennessee for the MLW show, which will be a all-female wrestling event. Uh, tell a little bit about that. Well, I mean, with that show, yeah, it's an all-women show. Um, Roxy's actually had more experience with MLW. You want to tell them more about that? Yeah, sure. MLW started for me in 2008. That's where I got to meet uh, Josie from TNA, and I met Helena Heavenly from WWE. There's just a lot of experience in that show, and a lot of girls, a lot of good people. The promoter is awesome. We love him to death. Um, That show, particularly on April the 30th, we're going to have our customs in the morning, and we're going to have our show that night. And if um, if you become a sponsor for Start Years and also Sassy Stephanie, that you know she's been around for a, a long time as well. 
Mm-hmm. Yep. So, so for more so, info on this um, all-female wrestling show, you can go to mlwonline.com. And if you want to be a sponsor mm-hmm. for that show, just uh, check out all the info over there. It's on the home page. And now I'm I'm very familiar with pro wrestling and indie wrestling, and I'm starting to get to be familiar with custom wrestling as well. It's kind of like uh, y'all. It's like fans booking matches and stuff. Uh, for those who don't know what custom wrestling is, and y'all too have been a part of that, uh, why don't you tell a little bit about how can fans book their own matches and stuff? Good, good. Um, well, like you said, I mean, you can visit their website. There is, you know, a lot of companies that do it. Um, one of our favorites to work for is, of course, MLW. Um, and you can get it from the same website, the MLW Online, and there is a link there for the custom wrestling. But basically, once you go in there, you get to pick from the girls that's on the lineup. You get to tell them what you want to see. If you want to see hair pulling, eye raking, choking, if you want to see, you know, the good guy just completely wipe out the bad guy. I mean, wrestling is entertainment, and this is up to you. If you tell us what you want to see, and we'll perform it for you, and you get it in a DVD or a download. Oh, well. Yeah, all the way down to our hairdo, all the way down to our one piece that you want us to wear, what you want us to say, if you want us to say your neck. But me, um, there is a promotion out of um, around the LJ Georgia area. We were just in Blue Ridge, Georgia last week. Um, it's owned and promoted by Big Will. Um, he's been around for many years. He's a very close friend of mine. It's called Deep Southern Championship Wrestling. That is one of my favorite places to work because the crowds are awesome there. And those are, you know, basically my two favorite places to work right now that I go to steady. Mm -hmm. uh, For those who are just joining us, uh, we have both members of the Rockets here on Channel with Jeff and Kenny C. We have Tiffany Wax and we have Wax C. Um, Has there been any wrestlers out there that you like to go up against, but you haven't had that opportunity? And if so, who who are some of the wrestlers, either tag team or singles wrestling, that y'all want to go up against? Uh, now, for me, um, you know, I would like to wrestle the beautiful people from TNA, mainly because I do respect Angelina Love or Angel Williams in the ring. I think she's an awesome performer, and, you know, that's a tag team that we can both work with. Um, and I think she's actually going to be with us on Monday. We are going to Sleeper Kids World. It's also another uh, custom style wrestling that we do. Her, um, Rain, and also Lacey from Shimmer, they're all going to be there this uh, next Monday. And I don't know the website for that, but it's under Sleeper Kids World. But those would be the two mm-hmm. that I'd like to work with as far as tag team. But as singles, I'd love to work with Tara from TNA or... Uh, Trish Stratus. She was, you know, had to do with me wanting to become a women's wrestler because she started at the bottom and worked her way up to a great performer that she is. Wrestlers and y'all wrestling fans yourselves, um, what's your thoughts on Snooki's performance or lack thereof, I should say? She surprised the heck out of me. Really? Yeah, that's my thoughts exactly. Um, I mean, wrestling is about entertainment. So, I mean, if you have to bring in those stars, which wrestling mm-hmm. has for many years, she actually surprised me with the mm-hmm. skills that she had. Okay. Yes, exactly. Uh, so, and, and what's y'all take on, on, on Trish Stratus? And it seems like some other wrestlers keep uh, coming back. Well, uh, how do you feel about them coming back for a short term? That's just awesome to see them again and see that they're still alive and still kicking, really, because you never know once they leave the WWE. Uh, all right. Uh, for those who are just tuning in, we are joined with the Rockets here on Chilling with Jeff and Kenny C. Thank you, everyone, for joining us. Again, check them out, facebook.com forward slash the Rockets zero one. Check them out. And um, you can also... You're also giving away merchandise and T-shirts and pictures and stuff. Uh, where can people can contact uh, y'all for for merchandise? 
Um, you can get us on the website. You know, the Facebook page has been given out. Um, also, you can actually contact our booking uh, email address, which is rocket, R-O-C-K-E-T-T-E, bookings at AOL.com uh, for information on either bookings or merchandise information. Either one of us will get back to you as soon as we can with that information. All right. Uh, again, check it out. Facebook.com forward slash the rockets zero one. Um, now, ladies, um, I just debuted a wrestling talk show on Thursdays. And if y'all got any free time in the future, I'd like to have y'all on that show as well. Uh, just debut it. Uh, it's hosted by Jeff and myself. Uh, we talk all things mm-hmm. wrestling and we just started looking for interviews and such. And we would like to have y'all on that show for another interview or whatever. And, uh, we get, get updated with y'all, what, what y'all been going through lately. Oh, that sounds okay. awesome. You just, you know, get with us and, you know, we'll make the time for it. All right. Uh, now, y'all going to be at uh, TCW later on tonight at uh, Graysville, uh, Tennessee. Um, y'all, mm-hmm. y'all, are y'all teaming up on that on that event or y'all in singles action? What's going on there? I don't know. We're teaming up. No, no, no. We're definitely tagging. <laughs> yeah, we're definitely tagging. Oh, yeah. Um Doing this tonight, um, we're taking on Jessica Wetmore and also Black Widow. We've actually been, you know, it seems like they've been chasing our coattails for a little while. Uh, no pun intended, <laughs> but uh, you know, just we've actually been in a big food, uh, feud with them, you know, for the past couple of months and ongoing. So mm-hmm. it's going to be, you know, the Rockets against them tonight at TCW. <laughs> them. <laughs> And, and what does TC yeah. what does TCW stands for if you don't mind me asking? Oh yeah, TCW is a uh, Tennessee Champion Wrestling. All right, so uh, Tennessee Championship Wrestling at Graysville, uh, Tennessee. That's tonight. Uh, the Rockets are in action. Go check them out over there. Uh, before we let y'all ladies go, and uh, we do appreciate you both calling in. Uh, we would like for you to do two voice drops for us. Uh, one for this show and one for uh, a place that we summer cast in. And we want, I want to start off with the show first. Um, all you got to do is say your names and the name of your tag team, of course. Your tag team name. And right after that, you, uh, right after you say your names, you say you are chilling with Jeff and Kenny C. All right, yeah, we can definitely do that. All right, whenever y'all ready. All right, this is Tiffany Rock. We are the Rockettes, and you're listening to ITMI.com. ITMIRadio.com. I'm sorry. That's Let's what? see, Roxy can take this one. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm trying to oh, get my gear now. Go ahead and take <laughs> it. I'd have to write it down. <laughs> Nah. I'd have to rock that down. ITMIRadio.com, right? <laughs> ITMIRadio.com. Okay. <laughs> okay. This is Tiffany Rocks. And this is Rock and Roll Roxy. We are the Rockets, and you are listening to ITMIRadio.com. Perfect. Bravo! Yay. <laughs> this is why I wrestle and don't do radio. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it, <All> right? <laughs> no, that, that's okay. You know, a lot of people got it a lot worse, so don't don't feel too bad. <laughs> and uh, we got one more question before we let y'all ladies go. A, a question from Fozzie, who's a wrestling fan himself. Would y'all both mm-hmm. offer? Would y'all both consider off a offer? from a top organization like TNA or WWE? Mm -hmm. That is a difficult question. I've actually been toying with. Um, Self, depending on the direction TNA is going, um, I accept an offer from them because of the schedule. WWE, no. I couldn't travel. And plus, I think I was too old to be a diva. (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> well, for me, I would um, 
be very thankful if it ever happened to me, but I would not take either one because I want to raise my child, and I do not want to raise him on the road. So that is my thoughts exactly on that. Understandable. Understandable for both of y'all. Uh, yeah, right, but so. being on the level that we are, you know, in a little bit of background about, you know, being on the indie circuit or the outlaw circuit, you get a lot of fan you know, interaction that you just can't get on that level. And it's self-satisfying to see that fan reaction. And that's another reason why, you know, it'd be hard for me to leave the level I'm at and go to one of those bigger shows because I really enjoy that fan interaction. Yeah, the, 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 mm-hmm. indie, cir- yeah, the indie circuit, and I've been to a couple of them. And uh, any final words before we let y'all go? Oh, no, thank you so much for having us on. This has been a great experience. This is a first for us. So. <laughs> wow. That's, that's yeah. Thank All you right. very much. All right. Thank you, ladies. Y'all have a great weekend. Sure. Bye-bye. All right. Bye-bye.